good. All right. All right. Second answer is 2 and 47. He said, so he answered and said unto me, it is, it is, the, Lord, it is the son of the power whom they have confessed in the, in the world. Then began I greatly to commend them that stood so stiffly for the name of the power uh -huh. of the Lord. It's like, go ahead. All right. Then the angel said unto me, go thy way and tell my people what manner of things and what great wonders of the Lord thy power, uh, <coughs> thy power thou hast seen. Right, so the, the point was stiff mm -hmm. and then un, unmovable. Read what you got, uh, Shamaria. Matthew 10. Yeah. 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 Matthew 10 and 22. And ye shall be hated of all men for my name's sake, but he that endureth unto the end shall be saved. And that's the whole point, man, enduring, man. So what's yeah. all this talk about the, the Christian church talks about, oh, come and get baptized and you'll be saved. Yeah. You know, saved from what? You know? If we're if we're, if we're if we're if we're right here in the fire, and the people's coming, and we we call rescue, and we see the rescue coming, are we just gonna lay it back in the fire like, oh, we will say we ain't got nothing to worry about, <laughs> you know? No, man, we got you know until actually matter of fact until we get beat up on them chariots, that's what we're saying. Right. All right. That's when you rightly if you can say, yeah, I'm saved. Okay. I mean, hey, you know what? Hey, one before you. And before you even uh, look for help, before you can, because when you, you need to be saved, that means you didn't exhausted all possibilities that you can help yourself. If you when you drown it, you flop and beat the water and shit. You 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 trying to save yourself. You know, and so it's an effort in it before you the, the before the before the uh, before Life you gone. you know what I'm saying before the, the actual act before you actually die. Before you die and get gossip on all that water, you beating the shit out that water, and all of a sudden when somebody whoever's coming to save you, you just. You know, you grasp the ground, you all you know, all you know is oh shit, he saved me out of that. You know what I'm saying, but it's an effort before that happens, man. So same thing with the truth. It has to be an effort, man. You know what I'm saying? You ain't gonna just sit there like you said in the fire, man. You said, oh shit, oh man, here the ambulance coming. You sitting there burning like a motherfucker, oh shit, I'm gonna wait for them to save me. No, man. We throwing the lifeguard yeah, bro, and you mean, like, I'm good, I'm gonna I'm, I'm wait on I'm my a, friend. Yeah, they come. I'm gonna wait, my, the lifeguard I'm right behind you, I'm gonna wait on him. Get right. The fuck out of that That's stupid, man. That don't even make sense. Go ahead. Second Ezra chapter seven verse one. It says, "And when I had made an end of speaking these words, there was sent unto me an angel which had been sent unto me that night, the night before. And he said unto me, Up, Ezra, and hear the words that I hear the words that I came to tell thee." Verse three. And I said, "Speak on, my comrade." Then he said he unto me. The sea is set in a wide place that it might be deep and great, but put the case in an in a entrance where it narrow like a river. All right, and this is, some, this is a parable, all right? He said the sea is deep and great, all right? We're talking about the kingdom, man. It said, but the entrance thereof is narrow like a river. You know, the, the narrow is the straits, the, the positions of difficulty, you know? Verse 5, it says, who then go into the sea to look upon it, to rule it. And he and he went not through the narrow. How could he come into the broad? And the broad is the kingdom, right? That wide sea. So if you don't go through the straits and the, you know, the, the afflictions, then how could you accept the kingdom? You know? Verse 6. And that's why I said if you uh, basically because it's a law. If you don't go into your, well it's not a law, but if a, if a police officer come and you don't have the key or if you don't go in by the front door you can try to go in any other place of the house they basically will try to pull you over and say oh well, what are you doing you're trying to break in just to show you that if you don't go in by the front door any other place they will count you as a, a as a thief or burglary. somebody that's trying to break in that's right burglary you know burglary mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. just to show you that it's only one way to get into the kingdom of heaven man and what's that way through the straight and narrow go ahead uh, thank you just to say you want to According to scripture, mm -hmm. I'm trying to get another way. Uh, same as a thief and a robber. The same as a thief and a robber. Right. Oh, yeah. Is that because you which, think? Which, that's the straight. Yeah. That's why uh, for the book of say, the much tribulation you should enter to the kingdom of heaven. That's right. So you, you've got to do with the tribulation. Yeah. yeah. That's what comes with it, man. You know? Yeah. The servant is not greater than his master. You know? Right. It also says, um, seek to save his life should lose his life man okay so you can't there ain't nothing you can do in this life man to save yourself man 
I mean, salvation is salvation. You can't say salvation is free to get, but you got to work for it. You still got to work for it. Hey, you know, I, I gave this example once before, man. A uh, teacher in my school gave us all an A. They said, hey, I'm going to give you everybody in here an A. This first day of school. Everybody get an A, but guess what? You got to maintain it. So guess what? At the end of the year, if you didn't do nothing, man, you think you still got that A? No, man, you have to work. You have to maintain that A. All right, so 